Hey guys, Coach John here. I'm going to go over uh, Belly ISO. and I call it Blue Belly 33 Ice. We use blue for motion. Uh, Belly's the name of the series. We got our three back going through the three hole and we label it ice instead of ISO. Uh, so let's start with the front. Uh, we got a 4-4 defense here. Up front, because we, we have an A-gap defender here, we're going to end up fan blocking this up front. So tackle's going to kick out the end, guard's going to block, uh, gap down on the nose. Our center and all backside are going to step play side. So we should all get a fire step here, play side with all of these guys. If we get a, the nose is in the two, but we think he's going to come a gap because he's like a two eye, then we're going to end up with the center picking him up because that's going to be a hard cross block for the tackle to get to. And he's going to end up working up to the will. If he lines up in the A gap, our guard knows, and we have a, a call for it, we just, you know, make a line call adjustment knowing that these guys are going to fan block it. So in that case, the center on his fire step is going to punch on the nose, sorry, nose, and work up to backer. Same with these guys here. They're all scooping to second level. If there's nobody uh, uh, in their play side gap, they're going to work up and scoop. This guy's going to end up crossing his face, so he's going to end up reaching and picking him up. And you can do two things with the with the tight end. You can run him on a touchdown block, which he's probably never, most, most of the time, never going to get there. You could hinge him, you know, and cut off backside pursuit. Um, I like sending him on the touchdown block because then it sets up the belly keep pass later. Like as he's always releasing to that second level to come over and get his touchdown block, when we end up going to play action pass, he runs that same route, right? And he's and he's getting that the corner. So I run him on a touchdown. Okay, over here we got the corner. It's gonna stalk. And then for our backfield. So we're going to get a lead block. And a lot of times what I had trouble with here was that our two would end up taking an outside path and kicking him. And then we'd get tackled by the will. So, you know, key coaching points there. Make sure we get the inside defender um, with this two back, which gives us a lane out here with the three. Okay. Our three back is going to take a step to his left, straight up through the hole. He's going to look, after he clears the tunnel, to look to get outside. But if the cross touchdown block does get there and cross his path, you know, then he's going to come up underneath it. Our quarterback is going to reverse pivot. And he should end up about 45 degrees from where he started. So he's going to take with his left foot a reverse pivot at 45 degrees, about half a yard. And on this, on the second step, he should be completely concealed. The ball should be in his be belly on the second step, completely concealed. On the third step, he's going to come all the way around, and this is where we get our mesh with the three. And that's really key because the footwork in this play is going to set everything up later. The great thing about this, these system-based offenses, the first two to three steps of all these backs are always the same. So when we're in the belly series, whether we're running iso, tackle trap, belly sweep, keep pass, everything for the first couple of plays looks the same, which makes it extremely hard on the defense to, you know, decipher what's coming at them. So we got a, a reverse pivot mesh, and then he's going to run the option after he hands off here. The four back is in motion and he's running the option path with a slight trip. So, you know, this, this sets up a lot of things because with the motion in, we can run a rocket toss outside, we can run option outside, or what I like to do is 
once this play is established and set up and we're, we're pounding the rock with ISO, then we run belly sweep with no mo. Um, and we'll go over that in a second. So this is blue belly 33 ice. This is the staple of, uh, you know, running to the, the quick side. Um, great play. You can run it with motion, without motion. Um, but uh, this, is, this is the beginning of, of, of the belly series. So here's an example of if we had to run this against an odd front here. I got a, a nose, two threes, and, and, and the ends out wide and contained. Um, so here we are going to cross block it, right? We're going to be down blocking, gap down backer with the, the tackle here. He's going to let the tackle go first, and he's going to kick out the end. And then our two back now has a, 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 a straight shot to the wheel, a better angle on the wheel. Um, we're still... Fire stepping with all of our backside. We got a nose on, so he's going to pick up the nose. Uh, he's going to scoop, 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 or excuse me, sorry, touchdown block. Uh, if the if the guard can reach the nose here, great. Usually, what I like to have my guy, my center, do here is post on the nose. Right, uh, and then we're gonna feel the double from the guard as he reaches, and then we're gonna slide to to the mic. Right, just basic double team uh, work here. Make sure that this guy doesn't penetrate. If the mic is making the tackle, that's okay. Right. What's gonna happen is, as the play caller, as the offensive coordinator, I want to know who's making the tackle. So, if I see that the mic starts making the tackle because he's crashing hard and we're not getting there. Well, the next play in the series is going to be Tackle Trap, and I'm going to run right to where he's at. So once you start to see those tendencies, just like if we were in the 4-4, right, and the wheel's out here, and he's crashing, he's making the tackle, well, then, then he's not respecting option. He's not respecting belly sweep. He's not res respecting rocket outside. So you can see it just sets up the next. So whatever they do, I'm gonna. it tells me what I'm going to run next. I don't, I don't have to be a genius. I just have to watch the defense. See who's making the play and call the next play in the series. So, blue belly, 33 ice against an odd front.